Component number three, a curing lamp that emits ultraviolet light. Did you know that the sun will put out the correct ultraviolet wavelength to cure resin? But should you rely on the sun to cure your resin? No, you should not. You never know how long the sun will take to cure the resin, or even if it is cured completely. It might be cloudy or rainy, the air could be polluted, blocking much of your ultraviolet light. Many UV curing lamps have similar problems. Some don't put out a consistent ultraviolet light. Others are not tuned to the curing properties of the resin. If you were to use a simple off-the-shelf ultraviolet lamp to cure your resin, you would not know how long it would take or even if it would completely cure the resin. It may look cured, but really that's the problem. You cannot just look at a repair to see if it is actually repaired. An ultraviolet lamp that is not designed for curing resin may or may not actually cure the resin completely. You will never know for certain. The Glassweld Procure curing lamp is designed to cure Glassweld resins. The resin requires a specific ultraviolet wavelength, and the Procure is designed to put out this exact ultraviolet wavelength. Every Glassweld curing solution is fully powered and designed to deliver a consistent ultraviolet light that does not fluctuate and does not change. With the Procure curing lamp, you will get a consistent, complete, 360 degree cure every time. Like any windshield repair component, you will have to perform various maintenance tasks. One such task is the replacement of the bulb in the Procure. Because of the Procure's unique design, the removal and replacement of the bulb requires a special technique. The following will demonstrate this technique. As we move through each step in the process, we will define the main part being referenced. As with any step in the learning process, practice does matter. With the Procure on its back, we first remove the thumb screw. Once the thumb screw is removed, we then remove the bulb shield plate. At this time, also remove the bulb shield. Replace the thumb screw, but do not over tighten. We do this to assist in the removal of the power plug from the lamp. Holding the thumb screw in the forward position or towards the bulb to keep the socket from moving, Carefully remove the plug by pulling it straight out. A side-to-side -side rocking motion can also be used to loosen the plug. Once again, remove the thumb screw. Now carefully move the bulb socket in the direction of the bulb to gain access to the Allen head set screw. Loosen the set screw by turning only one time. Again, replace the thumb screw without over tightening. While holding the thumb screw to keep the bulb socket from moving, carefully separate the bulb from the bulb socket and remove the bulb from the lamp. Carefully insert the new bulb into the lamp and push it into the bulb socket while holding the thumb screw to keep the bulb socket from moving. Look at the plug end of the bulb socket and make certain the bulb pins are fully inserted into the bulb socket. Here, the bulb socket has been removed to assist you in picturing what the bulb pins should look like once the bulb is fully inserted. Once again, remove the thumb screw and tighten the Allen head set screw. Replace the thumb screw without over tightening. Then, reinsert the plug into the lamp. Make certain that the square hole in the side of the plug is visible through the oval hole in the lamp body. It should appear as this. 
Remove the thumb screw and then replace the bulb shield. Replace the bulb shield plate. Make sure the tab on the plate is inserted into the square hole in the plug. Replace the thumb screw and tighten. Now let's test the bulb by plugging the power cord into a 12 volt power source. Notice the green LED indicating the lamp has power. If the bulb is correctly inserted into the Procure, the lamp will illuminate. This is quite a process, but it is worth it. We do recommend replacing the bulb every four to six months depending on usage. The Procure is an indispensable component of your G3 Fusion repair system. With proper maintenance, it will give you years of complete repairs. Thank you, my